Careful, Peter Quill. In my experience, children often booby-trap their toys. It's not Nikki's, it's mine. So we're just claiming our stuff now? Because if we are... No, I mean it literally used to belong to me. Uh, Quill, you gotta see this. This kid's obsessed with you. Wait, why does she have your toy? It's just something I gave to Corel when we were together during the war, like a keepsake. It doesn't mean anything. Does, uh, this mean anything? How old is the child? Twelve. Ha! Congratulations, Peter Quill! You will make a terrible father. Unless the child is dead, in which case, it does not matter. W wait is this why you dragged us here? Clearly. The child is 12, and Quill was with the child's mother 12 years ago. The math is irrefutable. Did you know? Yes, okay. So the dates maybe kind of match up, so it's possible, I guess. It's not like they had a health class on this. Inspiring. Can we just focus on if Corell and Nikki are okay? They're clearly not here, so let's move on and keep looking. Anyone else feel weird going through Nikki's stuff like this? Peter Quill is her father. It is his duty to pry into her personal life. Pretty sure she ain't here, Quill. Still can't get over how good she is with all this tech stuff. Meh, I could do better. Yeah, but she's 12. So, I'm 15. Guess Nikki wasn't much of a Skrull fan. Name someone who is a Skrull fan. <laughs> Good point. Staring at it ain't gonna change what it says. It doesn't say anything. It's just some confused kid projecting stuff. Just some confused kid? That is no way to talk about your daughter. Huh. Not a bad workbench. For a kid. I'm thinking Nikki won't mind if we use this. What do you say, Rocket? I say I don't care even if she does mind. Got you covered. One fine tech upgrade, hot and fresh. Here you go. Okay, where were we? Congratulating you on being a father. Should be a way to Corel's office through those pipes on the left. Yeah, I see an opening. Could be there's a latch on the inside. Allow me, Star Dad. <laughs> I, I get it. <laughs> Guys. Could we not make light of all this? We still don't know if they're okay. I am capable of feeling concerned while still laughing at you, Peter Quill. Gotta admit it, Quill. Kid's whole setup is pretty impressive. The way she rigged her terminal to the emergency power grid. I told you, she's a smart kid. Perhaps Peter Quill did not sire this child after all. Yeah, I could see that. She just don't seem dopey enough. Maybe she gets everything from the mother's side. Yes, she should have exhibited at least some foolishness. If I had a kid, she or he would definitely be super cool and smart. So just like Nikki. I guess, maybe, yes. Yep, so definitely gets it from the mother's side. So definitely gets it from the mother's side. That's the elevator I took with Corel and Nikki. If we're lucky, maybe they're on their way down right now. When have we ever been lucky? So much for your girlfriend meeting us. It did seem unlikely. All I know is I am really starting to hate this elevator. <laughs> Oh! 
like we're due for a check-in with Rumble's Cosmo. more incessantly than a Catathian without breakfast. We really need to get you the So was this a coincidence, or did they know we were coming? Of course they knew. We ain't exactly a okay? Spring. Anyone hurt? What? Are you gonna start being all paternal now? We're fine, Peter. We know how to fight. I know. I, I just... We'll find them. Don't worry. You said Corral's office was up top somewhere? Yeah. Just need to make our way up. Next stop, Corel's office. Come on, just admit it, Quill. You're freaking out right now. This whole deadbeat dad thing's gotta be eating at you. Some need many years to fully comprehend their paternal responsibility. The prospect of maybe being a dad is... a little scary. A little? Embrace the panic, Peter Quill. It is the essence of fatherhood. So, where's this office, Quill? It's around here somewhere. Place wasn't this messed up last time. When in doubt, follow the stench of death. Huh. realized something. And Nikki's a tech expert, knows her way around ships, fits into small spaces. Don't you dare finish that sentence. And she seems to get along well with Peter. <laughs> Good luck replacing me with a dead kid. Comforting. Shouldn't you be focused on figuring out what's inside those batteries? Quietly? Nah, I tend to think better when I'm mouthing off. If that were true, you would have solved all the mysteries of the galaxy by now. Hey, who's... Hello? Corral? Nikki? Looks empty. Feels empty. Maybe they're hiding. There are always strange writings on the wall. I'm gonna try and get in her computer, see if I can wipe my criminal history. Rocket! I'm kidding. I'm gonna access her logs. You wanna know what happened here or not? Fine. The rest of us will take a look around. Maybe they left a clue or something. The scribbles are Cree. This one says, Mother knows best. Return. Hope. Promise. The resemblance is uncanny. She doesn't look anything like me. She's blue. Besides, why wouldn't Corral have just told me? Protect her daughter, Peter Quill. Copulating with you was a capital offense under the Kree purity laws. That's not a real thing, is it? The Kree are extremely strict about their bloodlines. So, when Corral said we shouldn't be doing this... It was being literal. Corel had a real artistic side to her. She was the only Cree I ever knew who painted and played music. I used to think it was a sign of weakness, but... No. It's a strength. Definitely a sign of strength. Oh, wow! The Cree have comic books? I am surprised. The Cree Council is very strict on approved forms of entertainment. So this could be, like, super valuable, then. How valuable are we talking? Nikki's ID. Something seems off, though. What do you mean, off? I don't know. Like it's been flagged or something. Not sure. Is the girl's date of birth on those documents? Does it match with the typical Cree gestation period? I really wouldn't know. I wonder if Nikki made this. I am Groot. Some kind of die machine. 
Is it normal for Kree to dye their hair? Not unless they're hiding something. Nikki! Obvious signs of a struggle, Peter Quill. Yeah, this doesn't look good. Ah, <sighs> oh, appealing. Any luck getting in? The thing's pretty well protected. I need time. All right, let me know. Seriously focused on food right now. Mystery makes me hungry. Hey, save me some, will ya? This must be Corel's first kid. I remember she talked about him a lot. He was on Hala, right? When the Shatari. Yeah. Her kid and her husband. Explains how fearless she was during the war. She had nothing to lose. What is this? Some kind of a threat? The Cree Council demands proof of Nikki's heritage under the Cree purity laws. From a legal perspective, copulating with you is extremely objectionable. From other perspectives, too. Uh, this does not look good. For you? No, for Nikki. What are the chances the Kree are involved in any of this? The Council of Purity isn't cryptic. When they punish someone, they make sure everyone knows it. Corel and Nikki would be hanging from a wall. Okay, I'm in. But I got bad news, lover boy. What did you find? Come here and I'll show you. So what am I looking at? Nothing. She's the captain. Captains keep logs. You keep logs? I I'm trying to tell you, they're gone. All of them. Almost like the world mind went out of its way to sever everything. Have you tried turning it off and on? What about backups? Doesn't every Nova ship have a central hub or something? A Nexus mainframe, yeah. If there's ghosts anywhere in the system, that's where. I categorically refuse. Not literal ghost, Drax. He's talking about data. Right? Yes, but we'd have to access the Nexus directly. Means going to the bridge. We're not leaving until we find out what happened. Center of operations it is. According to the ship's map, the bridge should be right through here. Dog report item. It's one of them priests down there, ain't it? Oh, crap. Uh, nuts to this. I'm out of here. Stop. Move. <laughs> <laughs> Death. Future reference! You guys really need to work on yourself! Hey! 
way! I'm not the one who broke the glass! Feels like I've been shooting that big bot for hours! It is as venerable as it is large! We must break it! Danger close, Rocket! I guess someone must think this is the most valuable part of the ship! I don't know! Back out Everything there. about this is just getting more and more dark and weird! We should switch to the hard stuff! What's next, Peter? I can't believe I needed help with that! Don't get too spread out! Well done, you two! A tactfully executed maneuver! Guys, what do we do about this big bot? Anyone else thinking that we need a robot on our team? I do not trust anything without intestines! We must tell the dog about the priest. Robot priest. I am Groot. Groot says the mutt's not answering. Keep trying. The rest of us can focus on figuring a way out. Really? This is the server room, right? And servers mean data? That'll do it. Well played, Peter Quill. I am Groot. How am I supposed to know why the pooch ain't picking up? Keep trying. Man, what I would give to get into some of these servers. I thought that was the plan. Plan is to get to the bridge and hope that maybe someone left the Nexus unlocked. Okay, so according to the map I saw, Nexus should be just above us. Uh, shall I throw the rodent? No! Come on! <sighs> Alright, let's look around. Maybe we can find something. Right? How the world mine seems to have gone completely dark? Very weird. Perhaps it is rebooting. Of all the words you could have used there, Drax, that one actually wasn't too bad. Thank you. It was either that or reloading. Yeah. To think, all of this could have been avoided had the rodent not broken the glass. You're blaming him for that? His panic scampering is what caused the final break. Your oversized gut is what caused the first 50 breaks. Guys! Pretty sure it was already cracked. Hey Groot, any luck getting through to Cosmo yet? I am Groot. Nope, still nothing. Reception will probably be better once we're on the bridge. Yeah, I don't think that's how it works. Perhaps we should have interrogated the robot priest. Yeah, next time we encounter a giant, deadly robot priest, we'll tie him up first and ask questions. Do you have rope? Okay, this is it, the command center. Which I guess makes that the next control terminal. Fingers crossed we find something useful. I'm thinking you should do the honors, Quill. Locked. I wonder, though. Nikki really didn't want her mom to know about this pass key she gave me. No way is some kid's card gonna bypass the next. We're in! You're kidding! Well, yes! Guys, we're in! Go to the criminal records, Quill. I wanna see my files. 20 units, mine's the biggest. I've heard of this guy. He's part of a private army called the Lethal Legion. <laughs> More like the Loser Legion. What is it with you, Humies, and your stupid names? Whoa, whoa, whoa! Star-Lord is not in the same league as Darkhawk, okay? One's the name of the greatest band of all time, and the other's... a bird! So, Drax's criminal record is pretty big. That is what your mother said. <laughs> it's great, because his mother's dead. I 
thought there'd be more here. Barely scratches the surface. I am Groot. You? <laughs> A gold dome? Over my dead body, buddy. You know, for a non-spacefaring species, us humans sure get around. Unfortunately. Hey, isn't that the guy we saw when we tried to pay our fine? Yeah, that's him. Look, it's Jax's girlfriend. Lady Hellbender is not my girlfriend. Yet. Isn't this your friend from the bar? Yep. Grand Unifier Raker. Wonder what he was looking for in the quarantine zone. Probably nothing good. Read it and weep, losers. There ain't a single scam me and Groot haven't pulled off. You name it, we've done it. If you're charged, it means you've been caught. You realize that, right? Your point? Wow. When Cree cops go bad, they really go bad. Actually, an accuser is the equivalent of a judge, jury, and executioner. Wow. Your record's a lot bigger than I expected. How big were you expecting? Minuscule. Another guy from Earth. I'm telling you, Quill, C-53 is the trailer park of the galaxy. Fun fact, that bounty Yondu put out is how me and Groot met Quill. I'm just glad I talked you out of collecting it. <laughs> Who says you did? I am unfamiliar with this Kree. One of the nameless. Oh, spooky. Get to the juicy stuff already. Channeling your Nova Force, a comprehensive guide to meditation and managing your mental health. Actually, I wouldn't mind a copy of that. Pass. Let me get this straight. She became a teapot? That's what my source said. <laughs> Amazing. I hate you all. Well, that don't sound good. The audio file must be corrupted. The audio file and everything else in the galaxy. Attention, away team. Please ensure your helmet cams are in full operation ahead of this afternoon's away mission into the quarantine zone. Thank you. Just like Corel, everything by the book. Yeah. It's a list of bucket heads. Ugh. We already know your girlfriend works here, Quill. So? It might have useful info or something. Agent of Thanos? Gamora, care to explain? Not really. Except that it wasn't me. Check it out. Nikki's got a file. Boring. I have heard of this one. He was a good man. Except good means scut when you're dead. Hey, Wall. Then who is running Novacor? That's a good question. He crashed into a Leviathan on purpose and is still a better pilot than Quill. Hey! What? You know it's true. Alright, let's take a look. Wow, super evident, Quill. And to think we could still be reading my criminal record. I was wondering how they knew about us. Quill must have tripped the sensors on the way out. Isn't that the mining rig from the quarantine zone? Oh, great. Looks like your girlfriend was collecting evidence against us even after the two of you struck a deal. I still do not understand how the Churchman's ship exploded. The Nova Corps is known for their security protocols. It's called stupidity, Drax. Something the bucket has got a lot of. Gotta be something in here. Hey. 
Wasn't that... The mining ship we explored in the quarantine zone, yeah. What is the footage from? Signal stronger. We must be close. How close? Hard to say. There's too much interference. Centurion Corral! Found something. After we left. Oh, Flark. That thing. You don't think. It is the creature that devoured our monster. <laughs> Could have been a million things. I mean, it's restricted space for a reason. I am No, you're a Lotus Scud. That thing's got nothing to do with us. Gem Corral picked up. I think it's the same one we shot in the quarantine zone. Uh, we? You're the one who shot it. Fine, the gem I shot. The point is, is that shadow thing came out of it. We did this. The quarantine zone's a giant death trap. So we released a shadow thing. We made it out, didn't we? Your stupid girlfriend probably did too. You've been saying the whole time she's probably dead. Eh, probably alive, probably dead, whatever. Important thing is, we're all fine. Corel is tough. If anyone made it out, it's her. I know it. Read our intentions. No, you've made them pretty clear. Sometimes sacrifices. <laughs> I had to check. Groot, write the stars. <gasps> Grand Unifier. Breaker. Right? First, let me just say it's really cool that you've heard of us, right, guys? And it's cool that you didn't try to kill us just then, especially with your two pals right there. You could have totally ripped us apart the moment you walked in, which we obviously all appreciate. But also, we've kind of got a few questions, like... Where are Centurion Corel and her daughter? You came here seeking truth. The Matriarch wishes to share it with you. Okay, that is really not cool. What do you mean he's not picking up? Come! The Matriarch awaits.